Okay, so for all backhand shots, whether they're clears, drops, or smashes, you want to use a bevel grip. And when you contact the shuttle, you want to contact it right here. So from the side, this is where you would contact the shuttle if you were to do a clear or a drop. And then for a smash, you want to hit it when it's just a little bit closer to the net. Okay, so right here I'm showing you a panhandle grip. Now, this panhandle grip will be used when the shuttle flies behind your body and you can't get a good swing with a bevel grip. Right, so, if the shuttle is really far behind your body, using a panhandle grip would allow you to apply the same amount of supination while keeping the shuttle in. If you were to switch to a bevel grip like this, you would see that when you contact it, your shot would fly out. Right, the first step is keep your arm tucked in. The second step is to lead with your elbow. Third is to extend your arm. And the fourth is to supinate. Right, so this is from various angles. And one thing to note is that when you bring up your elbow, you want to pronate your arm so that when you ex after you finish extending your arm, you can supinate more. All right, and then in terms of footwork, you want to basically do a lunge or a semi-lunge into the corner. And when your heel strikes the ground, that's when you want to hit the shuttle. For the rest of this video, I'm going to show you some clears, drops, and smashes using this stroke. So first, let's start off with some clears. Alright, so those two clears were struck at the optimal contact point. In this clear, it goes rather deep, so the contact point is a bit further away. Here are some backhand drops. As you'll see, the technique is the exact same, the contact point is the same, the stroke is the same, the only difference is the amount of power that you actually put onto the shuttle. And you can also control the shuttle and bring it more outwards as well if it flies into the middle. This right here is a reverse slice backhand drop, somewhat more deceptive. And here is a reverse slice from the side angle.